gust. Okay, gust. That is gust. He is the foul-mouthed member of the group. He is grumpy. He likes, he's very lazy. And he doesn't give an F about anything in the world. His only interest is sleeping and eating. Okay. But eventually his character is going to develop and you're actually going to find out that he's very protective and very loving and very caring. He just has a very unique way of showing it. So he is a kumiho. Okay. You have probably heard of the, the kumiho from, from Korea. There's a very popular um, drama, Korean drama. Uh, my Girlfriend is a Kumiho, starring Shin Min Ah. Okay. It's one of my favorites. Uh, they are foxes, a fox. So if a fox lives a thousand years or more than a thousand years, they develop an ability to shape shift to any other animal or human that they desire. And they are given a task or a mission they can actually, and if they fulfill that mission, they can become fully human and stop being a kumiho or stop being a fox. In the more current literature, they are always portrayed to be um, evil. But if you read in the early years of uh, South Korean mythology, you will actually find out that kumihos are, are, are very kind to the point of being naive as creatures. And men are actually the evil ones. So their their kindness are taken advantage of by men. So men would ask for their help to accomplish something. Humans would would um, ask for, for help and then take advantage of the kumihos. They also have... The kumihos are pretty special. They have um, unbelievable knowledge about heaven earth and humans man would try and steal that knowledge that wisdom from them and they do so through a marble which you can get through the mouth as well so if you're able to get it and then you swallow it you may be able to gain that uh, wisdom the ultimate wisdom about heaven man and earth but you have to do for another thing first and that is to observe and learn about the sky, man, and earth. The fall of man would usually be on their study of the sky. A lot of times they're able to study humans, they're able to study the earth, but they fail in understanding uh, the sky, which is sometimes portrayed as the divine, the divine and the, the superior entity. Because without, without the complete understanding of sky, man, and earth, then your knowledge actually becomes useless or when it, it, it becomes ego because it's incomplete. Yeah. Okay, so that's, uh, that's him. He came from a family of Kumiho. There's a lot more about Kumihos.